Hey, partner, it's auction time at Hollibirds again. It's summertime and the bidding is easy. The staff is jumping and excitement is high. Our summer 2020 extravaganza is so large that we split it to two different weekends. First one, part one, starts on June 25th. That's this Thursday at 8 a.m. Pacific time. And it runs through Sunday for four full days of auction and action-packed excitement. Now, part two starts on July 10th. That's a Friday and lasts through Sunday, July 12th. We've got a lot of great things in this auction. And let me see if Fred's over there. We can ask him to tell us about it. Hey, Fred. So tell me, Fred, what we got going on in this auction? What's happening on day one? Boy, we've got a great auction coming up. Um, hope you've had a chance to see the catalog here or online on your screen. Uh, and likewise, if you don't have one of these, you can go online simply and go on over here and it says click to view uh, the virtual catalog and you can go right on in and view that catalog right now. And it'll turn the pages for you, just like turning the pages in the catalog. There it is, just like that. So there's a lot of stuff going on in this sale. We've got collections from all over America in here. It's just absolutely phenomenal. And you know, the best way to do things is to go through that table of contents that you got right in front of you. It'll show you everything. First day is fantastic. We've got a lot of general Americana from across America, great historical stuff, an Idaho postcard collection, a bunch of jewelry, rugs, badges, uh, and all kinds of collectibles. And I'll say right now, one of the interesting things we've noticed is the badges are hot. And while we've only got about 50 of them in the sale, they're hot. Everybody wants their badges. Um, the second day, uh, there's some more badges and there's a huge amount of railroad stuff, including part of a railroad pass collection. That's one of the biggest pass collections in America. Uh, we've been getting it a piece at a time. Can't tell you whose it is, but let's just say it's a collector who's been at it for over 50 years. And it's got phenomenal material in it, over 150 different passes in this sale alone. We've also got a lot of stagecoach passes and things of that nature. Some of it coming from the Ron Lurch collection through a third party, uh, others from other sources. Uh, we've also got stocks and bonds from railroads, like usual, more out of the Ken uh, Prague collection mining stocks coming and by the way the mining stocks are now coming from three or four major collections again across america where they're sending us uh, bits and pieces of the collection at a time a lot of really good high grade material and it's very exciting for us because a lot of these certificates we've never had before with fantastic vignettes uh, we've also got a number of autograph pieces including thomas edison uh, and leland stanford on the third day uh, we get into a fantastic batch of minerals, over 100 mineral specimens, uh, roughly a dozen gold specimens or more, a number of them from California, Nevada, uh, across the United States and around the world, including Russia. So there's some great gold specimens, fantastic mineral specimens, um, all starting at very low prices, and we think you'll be happy with them. Fantastic condition pieces, professionally curated, uh, just fantastic, and the colors. Mama Nature's Colors of Minerals or Mama Nature's Best Artwork. It's fantastic. Uh, we also get into Native Americana cowboy and art material. There's a lot of it. We're specialists at Native Americana material, particularly in the art section and jewelry. You'll see some absolutely marvelous turquoise pieces, uh, other jewelry, and so forth, which is sort of the tip of the iceberg because in August, we're getting a major jewelry collection out of Central California from a jewelry store that closed more than 25 years ago, or actually 30 years ago, uh, uh, who had their all their jewelry uh, custom made in New Mexico. Uh, and then the guy drove all over America getting his turquoise to be put in there and it's spectacular. That's coming in August, but don't forget the stuff that's there now. Um, and we've always got a wide selection of cowboy art and the, and the like because it's very popular out here in the West. Uh, the fourth day is a humdinger. Uh, the fourth day is a numismatic day almost all day. So we have the Bart Laninger Arizona uh, uh, token collection. This collection is different than anything that's ever hit the market. There are more than 25, if not 40, AT, that means Arizona Territorially Designated Tokens, 
in this sale. There's never been a sale of this magnitude. It's phenomenal. This is the first part. It's wonderful stuff. We've already seen bidding by more than 25 different collectors for Arizona alone. We're happy to see that. It's from all the little mining camps, the famous ones you know about from Gold Road, Arizona to the ones you might not know about like Gold Dust, Arizona and some of the others. Great saloon tokens from both mining towns as well as uh, other communities like Florence that has a saloon token out of Florence and just great stuff um, from some of those great gold camps like Congress still active today right over there by uh, Rich Gulch and um, Potato Patch Hill etc. Uh, all this great stuff saloon tokens three different saloon tokens out of Congress absolutely phenomenal. We've got tokens from the John Reynolds collection in there more from the Central Valley California and then finally from the Benjamin Faber collector, the guy that wrote all the books on uh, counters out of the U.S. as well as some of the foreign counters. We've got a, a good selection of counters for the first time from the Faber collection. And then in August, we'll have most of the rest of it. And in August, by the way, we're going to have a major paper by yours truly on these counters because these references are so hard to get. A and B, understanding their significance is very difficult. So... We're going to have a lot of stuff there. I think you're going to love it. You know, we have so much material, we had to divide it and go into a second section. And we decided not to try to do it back to back because we've got the 4th of July vacation. We know everybody wants to be gone. They're enjoying being out even during COVID and camping with the family and enjoying mama nature and the outdoors. So the week after that, the second week in July, we're going to have the second part. We're calling it the dealer and bargain section. But it's not just for dealers and bargain uh, good lots. Um, it's less expensive material. And just because something's rare doesn't mean it's going to be expensive. So there's tons of rarities in those last three days. But we've started the prices very inexpensively to allow uh, every collector from beginning to expert to jump in and get some of the great stuff for your collection. So we've got wonderful material across the board, all aspects of collecting Americana from numismatics to maps to photographs to bottles to uh, documents and revenue stamps and covers and all kinds of things. It's all there. Uh, all you got to do is take a look at this catalog online. And by the way, there's a great search command in the upper right hand corner. All you have to do is type in those keywords you're looking for and it will show you where the lots are and you can go and read about them. Sign up online on iCollector live auctioneer or invaluable or auction zip, whatever service you like, uh, and go from there. So we look forward to your phone calls and your questions. You can bid absentee. You can be on the phone live. You can be here live if you wear a mask because we follow COVID protocols here and everybody's been very safe and healthy. We want to keep it that way. We want you to keep it that way. So give us a call with all your questions. We look forward to hearing from you. If you've seen one of our paper catalogs, you know how detailed and organized they are, presenting all the items that we have for sale with good pictures and great descriptions. But if you didn't have one of these delivered to your mailbox, oh, you can just go right online, go to our uh, website, fhwac.com, and click on a picture of that virtual catalog right there. And right in front of you, that catalog will appear, and you can flick right through it, right online, just like the real one. All the same pictures and all the same descriptions and prices are right there online for you, uh, right at your fingertips. You know, it's easier than ever to get involved in the online fun and catch some great deals on all sorts of historic items and interesting collectibles. Just uh, point your browser to fhwac.com and click on the register and bid on iCollector in the blue box. Then go to create account in the top right corner. There you can put in your information. And if you've already created an account for one of our past auctions, just go over to the right side and say sign in with your account. You'll get a new uh, paddle number for each auction. And for this auction, because we have two sessions, part one and part two, uh, you'll need to register for both of those sessions separately, and you'll get different paddle numbers for each of those auctions. But uh, come join us and uh, be a part of that action. 
you know, you can also join us on your handheld device. Just go to the Apple uh, App Store or Google Play and look for Hollabird Western Americana. And there you'll find our app for joining us on these auctions. And you can play right here in the comfort of your own home, right here on your little mobile device. Now you can participate on our auctions on iCollector.com, Invaluable.com, LiveAuctioneers.com, and AuctionZip.com. Just go to your web browser and uh, sign up on one of those sites if you haven't already. Get a bidder number and you can join us right online. And if you'd like to join us live here in uh, Reno, Nevada, uh, we have a small shop and we are observing COVID-19 uh, protocols, meaning that everybody is going to have a face mask. And we ask that if you're going to come, that you not be sick, not have a temperature, not been exposed to anybody who has, and that you wear a face mask for the whole time while you're here in the uh, auction room with us. So join us for Summer 2020 Extravaganza Auction starting Thursday, June 25th through Sunday, June 28th, always starting at 8 a.m. Pacific Time. We take a break and two weeks later come back for Part 2 on July 10th. That's Friday, July 10th through Sunday, July 12th. Don't miss it. We'll be looking for you.